The eccentricities of the Princess of Thailand. The hosts of the region of Coquimbo, Chile, had to meet a series of demands to please Princess Maha Chakri Sirindhorn. From a red carpet at the La Florida airfield to the use of gloves for drivers. It wasn't simply about an official visit by some minor personality. It didn't even qualify as a state visit, but rather a royal visit. Don't be fooled, this was an authentic member of the royals. It seems the visit by Maha Chakri Sirinhorn, Her Royal Highness, Princess of Thailand, was not just any old visit. As the local hosts of the princess, in this case, the regional government with the support of the municipal council of La Serena, who had to comply with a series of demands so that the arrival of Her Royal Highness met with all the protocols demanded by the Thai royals. With a red carpet. The princess travels with an entourage of 30 people, among whom one can find Thai embassy officials, astronomists, interpreters, bodyguards and servants. A special room at the La Florida airfield was demanded just for them. Never before had a red carpet been used to receive a visitor at the La Florida airfield. This time it was a requirement that the path between the plane, which brought her from Antofagasta to the terminal lobby, be covered by this addition. Likewise, a demand was made that the drivers who handled the entourage cars use white gloves. But that wasn't all. The princess is allergic to flowers, for which reason there can only be one specific type of flowers in the places where she happens to be. It emerged that she requested one specific type of chocolate, but without filling. To refer to her, one must address her as Her Royal Highness, and she cannot be greeted with a kiss, not even on the hand. Only when she extends her arm can one shake her hand. She never speaks to the media, whom she generally avoids. On the other hand, the princess requested books about the region of Coquimbo to know the area a bit better. She is staying at the most exclusive suite in Enjoy Coquimbo. The objective of her visit. The princess had contemplated visiting the Toloda Observatory in the historic center of La Serena with the aim of familiarizing herself with the astronomical and touristic sites of the area, in addition to studying the possibility of forming cooperation links in the science and technology fields. She was accompanied by the director of the astronomy program of the National Committee for Science and Technology, Monica Rubio, who said that there were many interests in establishing joint projects with Chile. The princess is very impressed with what she has seen. She is full of wonder with the international installations possessed by Chilean observatories. We are accompanied by three astronomers from the National Institute for Astronomic Investigation of Thailand, who are interested in maintaining links with national observatories. The mayor, Sergio Gaona, declared that this was a great opportunity since the region projects itself globally, which is important as Thailand is a leading nation which is in the process of expansion with the possibility of maintaining an exchange where the local councils are interested in maximizing the offers available as a region. Who is Princess Maha Chakri Sirindhorn? Princess Maha Chakri Sirindhorn was born on the 2nd of April 1955 and is the second daughter of King Pumipom Adulidej and as such she is a member of the Thai royal family. In that country her subjects collectively refer to her as Pratep in Thai, which means the angel princess. Her title in Thailand, according to the royal decree proclaimed in 1977, is not the female equivalent of her brother's royal titles, the prince and heir Maha Vajiralongkorn. As the eldest daughter of the royal family, excluding Ubol Ratana, who married a foreign commoner, her position is equivalent to a royal princess. Sirindhorn generally enjoys the admiration of Thai people and is considered the intellectual successor of her father. She spends much of her time helping her father with diverse projects and has never married. In Thailand, she is often referred to as the technology princess or the information technology princess due to her interest and experience in the application of science for the development of the nation. In addition to her passion for technology, she is a graduate in history and has a doctorate in educational development. She speaks fluent English, French and Chinese 
in addition to Thai, and is at present studying German and Latin. She has a deep knowledge of Chinese culture, as well as other Oriental cultures. In the last few years, she has paid many visits to China, both officially and private, for her studies of Chinese language and culture. She is an excellent musician. She plays the trumpet and various traditional Thai instruments, among them the ranap, xylophone, and the sodong, 